Hi, everyone. I am back with uh, Odin Bola. I, oh, I'm going to say this so wrong. I'm going to let you say it. <laughs> I should have asked you before we came on live. I'm going to let you say it. I do not want to mess that up. That's It's a beautiful name, though. Thank you. <laughs> So let me, I'll let you introduce yourself and then I will, uh, I'll give you a brief, I'll let them know uh, your background and, and where you're coming from. If you want to just let us know your name and your, your title, because you're coming you. from Ryerson. So thank you very much, Rachel. Uh, my name is Odun Bola Adeshope and I am the project coordinator for the Accelerated Cybersecurity Training Program at Ryerson University. Amazing. And that is so much better when you said it. I was not going to have that beautiful delivery. So um, I just, I wanted to pop on. I wanted to really thank Ryerson for being here today. They're going to walk you through some of their amazing, uh, or an amazing training program that you have at Ryerson that, um, you know, I'm sure everyone can benefit from. So just wanted to th say thank you very much. If anyone has any questions, you can put it in the stage chat. Uh, and as we go along here, uh, we can we can answer those questions. So thanks so much for being here. I'm going to leave you to it. Uh, and I, thanks again. Thank you very much, Rachel. I'm so glad to be here. And uh, hello, everyone. I hope everyone can hear me loud and clear. I'm going to share my screen right now. So I hope you can see my screen. Um, so today I'm going to be talking to you about the Accelerated Cybersecurity Training Program. And as Rachel has said, my name is Odun Bola Adeshope, and I am the Admissions and Recruitment Project Coordinator for the program. And um, so before I get started, I'm just going to try and pique your curiosity for a bit. Uh, but did you actually know that someone gets hacked every 39 seconds, right? Just imagine what that means or what that translates to, right? It's a lot of people getting hacked. Millions of millions of people uh, are vulnerable, right? And by the end of this year, the global annual cybercrime costs will reach 6 trillion US dollars. That is an all time high uh, for, for the internet, for the world as it is today and even before now. So all of this have pretty much just uh, uh, in increase our vulnerability as individuals, as uh, internet users, and as uh, people who who look for information here and there on the internet. But so, how does this translate to anything, or how does this affect you as an individual? Right. Um. That is why we're here. That's what I'm here to talk to you about. So, at the Catalyst, uh, where imagine the cybersecurity workforce, where you know the professionals are as diverse as the kind of challenges that they tackle. Right. So we have streams that are open to people who are from different uh, backgrounds and uh, even even your gender, right? So we have up till date, we have about 66% of our students who are female. We have people from various countries all over the world, actually about 39 countries. Uh, we have people who over 90% of our students also have uh, post-secondary education. But what this translates to really is people from diverse backgrounds, people from uh, uh, you know, whatever ethnicity it is that you are. What we just want is to create a diverse cybersecurity workforce so that these people can tackle challenges with different perspectives, different mindsets, and, and, and everything in between. And so the program basically is a seven month intensive cybersecurity training and certification program. It's intensive and it's a rapid workforce development program. And it's designed to actually help students or learners launch entry level careers in cybersecurity. So if you're interested, remotely interested in cybersecurity, then this is a program for you. And it's funded by the government of Canada, by Rogers and by RBC. And it's valued at $25,000 per student. If you do know anything about certifications in the IT world, you would agree with me that certifications don't come cheap, right? But you're going to be getting three certifications at the end of this program at little to no cost, right? So it's valued at $25,000. But we say, you know what, there's a registration fee. And that's all there is to the to the cost of this program. $500 uh, just upon registration into the program. So if you don't get accepted into the program, then you don't have to pay this. So really, it, it doesn't affect you in any way. And we have three cohorts per year. We have in February, we have in June, and we have in October of every year. Um, it's it's delivered with a hybrid model, basically. And what this means to you is you still don't have to leave your house, right? You you get to you know attend the program from wherever it is that you are. There's going to be three weeks in class live session. So like this kind of session that is live, you're going to have three weeks of that uh, within the seven month program. And all of whatever else is left of the three weeks is just self study, right? 
you have lots of models, materials, books provided to you to study. But every week you have weekly check-in calls with mentors, with industry professionals, with people who are dedicated to your success just to see that you, you succeed in this program. We have partnered with uh, the leading uh, cybersecurity training provider, which is SANS. And we've also partnered with the one of the top most industry recognized um, certification providers, which is GIAC. And you will be getting the foundational cybersecurity technology certification. You're going to be getting the security essential certification, as well as the certified incident handler certification. So that's three certifications at the end of seven months. That is amazing. Trust me, it, it's, it, it's not easy to come by these certifications. And if you really want to maybe look look up these certifications, you can just go to science.org and, 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 and read about all of these cybersecurity certifications, right? And you will realize for a fact that these are top-notch certifications which will help you launch an amazing career in cybersecurity. I did mention the different streams earlier. So we have the women in cyber stream. We have, uh, so for anyone who identifies as female, we have for new careers as well. Uh, so if you've lost your job within the last 36 months, I know for a fact, right, that a lot of people lost their job due to COVID. So if you fall into that category and um, for some reason you're interested in cybersecurity, again, this is the program for you. We also have a stream that features uh, new Canadians, right? So you've been in Canada, say, three years. You've struggled to find a job that aligns with your career uh, goals, with your education, with your skills. Then this is a program for you as well. As long as you're a Canadian citizen, you're a permanent resident or a convention refugee, uh, you're a minimum of 18 years of age, and you are currently not enrolled in another academic program. This program is pretty intensive. It requires you to study for a minimum of 25 hours per week. And you know what that translates to, right? Uh, so that's why we recommend, and it's actually not, uh, you shouldn't be en enrolled in any other ac academic program during the course of this program. Now, um, you may wonder again, so, okay, yes, you've said all of this. Why then should I choose this program? I did say earlier that um, there are a bunch of people who are dedicated to your success. They are committed to you. To, to seeing that you succeed on this program. So they're gonna be doing weekly checking calls to see how you're doing with your study plan. If you need any help, if you're going through any challenges regarding your study, then they're here to help you. Uh, they provide one-on-one -on -one support. We also connect you with alumni coaches. And what this does to you really is, you hear firsthand information from people who've been there, done that. They've been through this program and now they're working, right? So you can ask them whatever questions it is you have regarding the program and how you think, how you wanna, uh, find a job in the cybersecurity space afterwards. Uh, we also have, we foster a strong uh, student community. So we have an amazing orientation program that onboards you into the program very smoothly. Uh, we also foster interaction between students, uh, study groups, because again, we know that um, <clears throat> it's important for you to build your network as, as an individual here in Canada. So again, we foster this, we try to help you uh, interact with your your group members and and that that helps a great deal from experience people find this very helpful sometimes they're studying they get stuck they just ask a, a fellow student and the person says oh yeah this is how to go about this and then it just becomes easier more than anything also it's um it always feels good to know that someone is also on the same journey with you and and you're not in this alone right so we also help provide that much support to our students now we also provide access to our uh, sans technical mentors we partner with SANS, right? And then they also provide us with mentors who are industry professionals who can answer some questions that you have, who can also support you in the course of this program. Now, when all of this academic piece is done, we also have a career development piece. And this part I find really interesting, really amazing, right? I mean, we take you through the academic components, you learn about cybersecurity, you learn how to handle uh, incidents in, in, in your uh, organization's network. And now you come, okay, how do I then thrive in the workplace? How do I get started finding a job? So we help you review your job search strategies, provide you with actionable strategies, right? Uh, we help you with preparing for your interviews, resume preparation, and all of that, just to ensure that you're ready to be able to thrive in the work uh, in the workplace. And uh, we also have information sessions with employers where we connect you with them. We ensure that you you're connected with employers who are currently hiring. Uh, for cybersecurity roles who can help you thrive in your career and more than anything also we know for a fact that this is an interesting field you have uh, dedicated your time and efforts so from experience from all of our students who have gone through this program and who are now working the minimum pay has been fifty-five thousand dollars per annum and it goes up to eighty thousand dollars depending on again 
maybe your previous technical background and all of that. But for an entry level role, fifty five thousand dollars is amazing. Trust me. Um, so this 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 much uh, we provide with you with if you uh, enroll as part of this program. And um, we also have our alumni work in all of these organizations. I don't mean some of them, right? All of these logos that you see here, we have students from our program who work here, right? So it's not, there's no gain saying in this. This is just what it is. This is no, no uh, sugar coating or anything. And uh, we have amazing stories from our alumni, right? So one of, uh, there's one of our alumni and I find her own testimony very, a testimonial rather, very intriguing because she's somehow being able to tie her, uh, her cybersecurity role, her cybersecurity job into her purpose of existence, right? So she finds it fulfilling, right? Everyone more than anything wants to be able to find fulfillment in their work. And she has already found fulfillment by just being a cybersecurity professional. Uh, another alumni has also said the same thing that he's literally dedicated to helping or to empowering people who are vulnerable. And he's, it feels like he's able to do that being a cybersecurity professional. These are amazing testimonials that honestly, they, they, they don't come by easily. A lot of people are working in places where they don't really want to work, but they're just doing it because they want to get by. So for you to be able to find a role, a job that, that gives you fulfillment, it's a big deal. And it's not something you should joke with. So we have amazing testimonies and there's more testimonials to come from our alumni. So um, if you do have any questions regarding the program, please feel free to check our website, cybersecurecatalyst.ca. Or you can send us an email at catalysttraining at ryasin.ca. And um, you can follow us on Twitter, on LinkedIn, on Facebook. Literally everywhere you go, you will find us. So uh, please follow us on all our social media uh, handles and platforms. And we'll be happy to answer whatever questions you have regarding this program. Please send us an email. I'm happy, excited to respond to your emails to give you more information. If you have any questions regarding your eligibility, into this program, please feel free to connect with us and we'll be more than happy to help you. Thank you so, so much for your time today. Thank you, Rachel, for having us here today. Uh, it's been great sharing uh, this, you know, brief information with you about the program. And I hope that I've been able to pique your curiosity uh, regarding cybersecurity, regarding this program. And um, hopefully uh, I will be getting uh, applications from some of you who might be interested in this program. Thank you so much for having us today. So I'll be taking questions now. I will be monitoring the chat box. If you have any questions, I will answer your questions from there. Thank you very much. Okay, uh, William says six trillion. <laughs> yes, yeah, six trillion dollars, US dollars actually will be lost. So uh, Tenzin, thank you very much. I see that you're interested in the program. Please send us an email. Catalyst training at ryasin.ca. If you're interested in the program, please feel free to send us an email at catalyst training at ryasin.ca. Um, I'm also putting in the chat box, the, the our website is also here. So this takes you directly to the to our website where you can find details of the program. Please feel free to connect uh, with us. We're more than happy to answer whatever questions you have regarding this program. So uh, William, so this is a pro, you, the $25,000 is the value of the program, but all you have to pay is $500 if you get admitted into the program. So I don't think anyone needs to get OSA for $500, right? If you apply today and you start to save $10 a day, I'm sure you'll save up to $500 in no time. Can I see this program as how to become a hacker? Let's say ethical hacking, right? So you're going to be thinking like, you need to be able to think like a hacker for you to, to for you to be able to uh, tackle whatever challenges that. So if they try to hack your system, you need to be able to think like a hacker as well. That you would also be learning. So ethical hacking is what you will be learning. I am not teaching you. This program would not teach you to be a hacker. No, we don't want you to be a hacker, but we want you to be an ethical one, right? What you will be doing is thinking like a hacker so that you can, you know, think, put yourself in their situation as a hacker. If rejected, it's fine. No. So William, you are not paying the $500 until you get into the program. So if you do not get into the program, you will not be paying the $500. You will not pay the $500 if you do not get into the program. Can technology program managers also apply for this program? Please feel free to apply. Um, the eligibility criteria is also here. 
I'm going to drop a link that takes you straight to the, yeah. So if you fall into these categories that I would also be dropping here, yeah, that's a link. That link takes you straight. If you fall into any of the three streams, we have a stream for women, we have one for new Canadians, and we have one for career changes as well. So if you fall into any of these categories, by all means, please feel free to apply. And if you're confused regarding your eligibility, also please send us an email and we'll be more than happy to clarify whatever it is that you do not understand regarding the program. Um, do I have any more questions? Okay, so thanks everyone for joining us today. Thanks for being a part of this session. I'm more than happy to answer questions again. If you want to send us an email, please feel free to send us an email. I will remain in the networking session. So if anyone also maybe wants to connect, uh, I'll be there to connect with you as well. So thank you so much everyone for today. I hope that I will get applications. I hope that I will get emails and questions from all of you regarding the program. Thanks and have a beautiful day. Bye now.